Hey there, welcome back to uh, XYZ 3D Printing. I haven't made a video in a while. That's because I don't get paid for it. I don't make any money. But hey, what the hell, I'll make one in any case. Right, so some member on the uh, XYZ 3D Printing group on Facebook asked, how do you get the panels off? So I thought I'll take five minutes and I'll show you. To strip the machine down, you'll need a T10 talk and a little upholstery wearing tool that you use for cars or little plastic something so you don't damage it. This machine is going to be stripped down for spares in case anybody wants any. Um, so let's start. We'll start with this side panel here. Plug goes in, lift that up, take the panel, just pop it in there, and pull that off. And it just pops out like that. No worries. Same on the other side. Let's get this thing off here at the back. It's a little flappy thing. So to do that, and if you can see, pop that off, job done. Alright. Next, we have to take this front piece off here. So you have to stick your head underneath. There's, there's two little clips, you just pop off with your fingers, on that side, and on that side, and that's it. Easy peasy. Now you've left with your LCD screen there. I'm just going to remove the tape that's holding it over here, I'm just going to pull it off. In case anybody wants to buy an LCD for the Vinci 1.0. So I'll pop that over there. Right, somewhere there. Alright, this is this piece over here at the back. This one here. Same thing, there's a few clips that hold it in. Here at the back, just here, just like that, boom. And then there's a little wire with a little optical switch there for the, say whether the lid is closed or not, and just take that line off. Alright, then after this, let's get that uh, T10 torque, two little screws here at the back, or just remove this back from the cover here. Save the screws, you know, it's nothing like a good screw. Yeah, that one's off. See, so this is where the uh, the board is, the motherboard for this uh, 1.0. It's still working. I'm going to be selling that if anybody wants that. All right, what's there? A little torch screw over here, so we'll take that off. Six little screws, off you go. 
Alright, this is the thing where the cartridge sits on, the cartridge reader over there. So we've got this little panel, the screw over here. And another screw at the top here. Keep those. off and you can just unplug the reader from the board easy peasy. Uh, I'm going to just take this LCD ribbon off so that it can stay with the board in case somebody wants it. By one time you pay for it. with the bottom panel, which is actually what somebody asked me. How do you get the bottom panel off? Right. Inside, four little screws, one in each corner. Just undo the screws. Screwed on it. And you got these little clips over here. I'm just gonna clip it. Give it a little tug there, push it, and then clip over there. Clip over here. Alright, 
that's that. We've got the stepper motor wire that's in there. It's just it just gets kind of bobbed through there and then up into the stepper motor. Anyway, that's how you take the panels off. See you later.